And welcome back to Let's Play Steambot Chronicles. I just came back to Nefroburg to avoid all the loading screens. So let's go see Connie. Uh, she said she would be at her mother's house. Well, mother's apartment. Speaking of which, we should probably head back to our apartment at some point. Thank you for coming. Is, is anything wrong? We got a letter from Dr. Nutmeg. It's about Mom. It says that she won't get better if she stays in the city. Oh, that's not Smoke good. from the auto and trotmobiles is making her even more sick. So... Hmm... Should... No, let's not... Let's just be nice. You need help moving. Yes. There's a town called Eurydica I want to take her to. It's not so much a town as a hole in the wall, but okay. It's her hometown, but it's kind of far away. Trains don't go there. Please, you're the only person I can trust with this. So yeah, we're going back to Eurydica. Sure, let's Glad take her. Service. Thanks a lot. Let's head to Eurydica. So yeah, for some reason all the sick people are going there. Also, in between episodes, I put the emergency bed on the cart so that uh, we didn't have to do it now. Also, did we just take the entire bed? Huh. But yeah, we're heading to Eurydica. That means we're probably going to need to take the train over to Happy Garland and walk from there. Since the train station at Eurydica isn't kind of operational. And it won't be operational until like post-game, I think. But yeah, Rosemary's on the cart now. She should be in the emergency bed, which is... Fusing into this building. Anyways, let's get to the station. Hopefully she can ride the bed pretty well. That being said, putting her right next to the exhaust for my trotmobile probably isn't helping things. Actually, wait, if we want to get her into the country, would somewhere like, uh, Vision Ranch be a good place? It's pretty close to home. And I'm pretty sure Dr. Nutmeg, Nutmeg, do, whoa, that came out weird. Do, Dr. Nutmeg wouldn't mind keeping her there. But nope, we're just going to go to Eurydica. The place that technically doesn't have anything. We kind of broke half the town last time we were there too. Although it does have a hot spring now. We can also go check on the miners real quick. We did put that ad in the paper. Let's see how that turned out. Oh, we have to wait until morning. Uh, let's just go stop at the hotel for a while then. We'll just stay overnight. Rosemary will be fine. Actually, we probably should have waited until morning to pick her up. I'm, sh I'm sure this place is kind of temperate. I mean, the weather's nice. For the most part. She'll be fine sleeping outside. Also, the middle of the street probably isn't the best place to load. Alright, so. Let's just head to the inn. We don't have a house in town, so... We can't stay here. We live in Happy Garland, after all. Welcome. Let us just sleep till morning. Oh wait, this room's occupied. All right, let's sleep till morning. And might as well grab breakfast. It's only 12 you are. if we'll ever wake up. Sometimes loading screens in this game can take a while. There we go. Let's see, got some stocks, paid our rent, and we are now the charitable hitman. That's an unusual title. I'm still not sure how we got the hitman thing. I mean, I'm pretty sure we didn't take out anyone important, I think. Anyways, let's get on the train. Next time we're in the area, we can go stop by the honey farm again. We can check if everything got rebuilt. I think it takes like a mission or two to get it rebuilt.
And at some point I want to go catch sharks. Cause why not? Anyways. I wish to get a ticket to Happy Garland. That's expensive, but oh well. At some point I should probably do some street musicianing just to get some more money. Let's go. All while Rosemary's still swinging in the breeze. The emergency bed always made me laugh. Just, just because of how ridiculous it looks. I mean, just because she can't walk doesn't mean she couldn't just sit in the Trotmobile. Or how even the carriage would work better than the emergency bed. Why? Because the carriage is stable. And has railings. Oh well. Anyways, we're here at Happy Garland. Alright, so my first stop is actually going to be the newspaper office. Uh, I want to remember to drop off my story before I do anything else. Also, I need to make more money. At this rate, I might not be able to afford my apartment for very much longer. Uh, so, let's head over to... where is it? I think Happy Bakery is the closest thing. We can also play a bit of music there to make a bit of money. Probably just want to do some practice. Let's do some violin practice. Newspaper office is right over here. No, wait, that's a church. Uh, stock exchange, there it is. Let's just park real quick and then we'll probably walk there. We can also sell some of the stuff we've been carrying around. Anyways, let's do a bit of music. Then again, this isn't a very high traffic area. The one near the Lobster Inn probably would work better for music. We can stop by right after the newspaper office. Why can't we get one of those cars? That looks fun to drive. Here we go. Time to go report the news. We have a new story for you. No, actually they lost. No, they won. Yes, I do. Oh, wait, no, I didn't mean to say no. Whoops. We can still tell her, right? Yes, we can. Okay. Yep. Technically, we didn't actually give any commands. We just kind of ran up behind the battleship and hit it until it blew up. Let's see, 10 you are. No stock, no stock. Oh well. Wonder what the stock prices of these things are now. Probably should have bought some before I turned in the story. Whoops. Let's go check that real quick, actually. I think it still takes like a day for the rise to kick in. Also, you know what? We're not in the army anymore. We can change out this uniform. Let's just put our normal clothes back on. Let me see. How much is... Where is it? Mary Dairy Farms, Urban... Urban Times. 60. How many do I have? I have 25. You know what? That's enough. I'm by one. Theaters are going down. Mines are still going down. That's going up. Uh, GTW is going down. Riverside's going down. Actually, no, these are going up. Did I already sell my railroad stacks? Uh, let's see. What am I holding on right now? Urban Times and Theater. We need to find more, more films for the theater if we want to make money off of those. But we can do that later. 
let's do a bit of musicianship and then we'll head over to Eurekia. I can never pronounce that place right. Alright, let's see. There should be a place to play music like right here. Here we go. I think we can get one from the Dawn now that we've given him a new, uh, Trautmobile arena person. I can't think of the name for some reason. Let's play in your voice. I also think there's a hidden one in Eurekia somewhere. Ugh. Yeah, I forgot. The violin's a bit more difficult than the harmonica. Also, it has a huge amount of silence. Then again, the violin is kind of a more difficult instrument in general. It's a pretty instrument, though. It's been a while since we actually just played on the street for money. We are attracting quite a crowd, though. Hopefully we get more people so we can get some good money. Oh god. My finger's slipping. We're still doing pretty well. People are clapping, at least. This probably would have been better in the evening, though, where we make more money in general. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna stick to the trumpet and harmonica. Still, we're attracting quite a crowd. There we go. Let's see how much money we made off of that one. Uh, 84. Not bad. That was enough for what we spent on the stock. Anyways, let's get to the Trotmobile and head over to Eurekia. Eure... DK. I can't pronounce the name ever. I don't know why. My brain just does not want to pronounce words today, apparently. And then once we get there, I think there's a film hidden there now that I think about it. I don't remember if you have to wait until Rosemary uh, gets there before it's unlocked. But we'll know soon enough. Let's just head over to... Where is the Cuckoo Forest deck? Oh wait, no, there it is. We can also see Dandelion while we're in the area, but I don't think he's home right now. Unfortunately, we can't actually buy any instruments from Dandelion. For some reason, he doesn't actually sell instruments at his instrument shop. Maybe he just sells them to the store in town, and then from there we can buy it. Also, I think we need a new guitar. Because I think our old guitar got turned into that monstrosity of an electric guitar that we have now. Oh well. Uh, how far away is the exit? It's right down the street. Okay, we're good. Oh, did we get gas? Actually, no, I think we're okay on gas. If not, we can just blow up some lumberjacking robots. Let's go. Wow, it's foggy out right now. Although it is supposed to be foggy often in the Cuckoo Forest. Anyways, let's head to town. Uh, let's see, I think this is the right way. Yes, it is. So we're gonna just go past Dandelion's house again. Also, we need to avoid those. 
You know, this is probably why your lumberjacking business is going down in terms of stock prices. You guys keep trying to kill people who want to buy your wood. Ow. Either that or you let some very violent people take a hold of your travel deals. Alright, this is the right way. Hopefully we don't get attacked again this time. Ow, that should hit me. There we go. You know, it's all wet now. Anyways, shouldn't be too big, but uh, too long of a trip to get there. There's Dandelion's house. There's the... I think that's supposed to be like a dam. They'll explain where they're getting all their electricity for Happy Garland. Also, new bird calls. Also, it's raining. Maybe we should have put a cover on the emergency bed. Anyways, it's right past this field. And there are enemies here now. That also means there's no boss here anymore. So that's good. Anyways, I think this is the right exit. Yeah, I see the town. We're here. Let's see how things have been since last time. We did put the ad in the paper for the mine. And we did uncover a, a hot spring. Oh, right. We were supposed to bring them stuff, weren't we? I forget what they needed. So this is where mom grew up. Where's your house? Toward the back of town, I think. It's right next to a well. All right. Well, we'll check that in a second. Oh, hey. The hot spring's getting built pretty well now. Uh, let's see. What else do you guys need? Awesome. Maybe we can take a dip in the hot spring. But yeah, thanks to us, basically the town is pretty much going to get revived soon. It's going to be a resort town soon. This brings back memories. Let's keep going. <laughs> yes, I know. At least we're not carrying her on our back. Alright, so I think her house is the one back here. Thank you for your help, Vanilla. Did we bring the bed with us, too? And excuse me. Just because no one lives here doesn't mean you can just barge in. Rosemary? Is that you? Daniel? You are the innkeeper's son. It's been so long. Is this your daughter? I'm Connie. It's nice to meet you. <laughs> You're just as cute as your mom was back in the day. Hell. And how about you, young man? <laughs> no, let's not annoy Connie. I'm Vanilla, Connie's boyfriend. Huh? But we didn't... <laughs> anyway, I'm the innkeeper now, so uh, let me know if you need a place to stay. You know, while we're here, we should probably check on Mallow, too. He well, has kind of been holed up in that house for a while. Well, I still need to unpack, and I'd like to clean up a little. Hey, can we stay here until tomorrow? Sure. Sure, we'll stay the night. I'll be at the end. Thank you. I was planning to stay here anyways. Why don't you go to the hot springs? I think you'd enjoy that. Ooh. That's a good idea. Maybe after I'm done cleaning. Well then, we should probably take a look at those hot springs. For now though, before we head to the inn, uh, I think there should be a film hidden in here somewhere. I, oh, I remember this one now. This one was so annoying to get. I had to look this one up. Since, uh, do you see the treasure chest? It's right there. You can barely see it over the counter. There we go, film reel four. I accidentally skipped through that too quickly. Oh well. And with that, I think we'll end the episode here. We got Rosemary to town, to uh, Eurekia. I'm just going to call it that from now on. And we got a new film. Also, at some point, we should probably stop by the hot spring. So, till next time. Actually, you know what's screw it. Let's go to the hot spring right now. Sure, why not?
We have that kind of money. Whoops, this is the woman's side. Yeah, we should probably not go on that side. Connie wouldn't be happy. This looks like this looks actually really nice. Although, for some reason we can't sit down, so we're just getting warm on our ankles. But yeah, that's the hot spring. Let's take a bath. But that was fun. What's our hunger at right now? Or it's still sated. But a little fun thing. And with that, I think we'll end the episode. So, till next time.